Uh, this is a sagittal section. This is anterior, this is posterior, through the inguinal canal. And right at the level of the external iliac vessels. This is the external iliac artery and external iliac vein. The more anterior and cordial you go, it will transform into the femoral vessels. This will be our uh, orientation level also when we demonstrate our block and when we demonstrate transduce superposition. Importantly, if you have a look at the whole area of the inguinal canal, there are clear borders and these guide us in the ultrasound image. From anterior to posterior and from inferior to superior, these borders are the external ap aponeurosis of the external uh, oblique abdominal muscle. In green indicated the inguinal ligament which lies caudally. The next layer that is important for us is the dorsal border of the inguinal canal indicated with purple arrows. This is the transversalis fascia and the last border is the upper border of the inguinal canal which is the lower end or lower rim of the transverse abdominis muscle which means we are mainly going for this area first of all not looking at details but within the inguinal canal you see this is a male uh, specimen, the spermatic cord. And this will be our target. That means we go inside the inguinal canal and stay at the spermatic cord.